Hello everybody, my name is Mr. Craven, and welcome to the demo for One Socket. Yeah, this is a, I think, escape room style horror game, where you have a bunch of different devices to use to keep yourself safe from a monster, but you only have one power outlet to use. Yeah, uh, the dev reached out, asked me to check it out, so I thought I would. Uh, thanks so much, bud, really appreciate that. Um, also, links in the description if you want to check it out yourself. Uh, charge the generator to power your devices, but be careful, you only have one socket, thus the name, one socket to work with. Uh, oh, ew. <laughs> Make tough decisions to keep you safe from the monster in the dark while you solve the mysteries that will free you. Do you have what it takes to survive? Probably not. Let's do it. Uh, new game? Boop. <laughs> Oh, that's an addiction. The dome has kept us safe from the nuclear winter for years. I love when they do that. It has sustained and sheltered us against the harsh world outside. It's like the Animal Crossing style voice acting. Voice acting. But our food supply is dwindling. Stocks are running critically low. World methods of production have failed us. It's only a matter of time before we have nothing left to eat. Like bread and carrot. Here at Addition Labs, we're working hard to provide for the future. But we need your help. Volunteer for our research team today. Never go hungry again. And safeguard our society's future. With a five-digit phone number? Oh, oh, is it? There's the socket. So what did I just turn on? <gasps> the phone number. I was not paying attention to the number. <gasps> we have axes and a pickaxe. Oh, it just loops. Got it. While that is doing its thing, I'll look around. Bed. Okay. Uh, I guess let's head back to the TV so I can get that phone number. Uh, let me grab. The pen and paper, just so I don't forget. I think it was like five, five something. Come on. Okay, it was. One five five oh five. Okay, one five five oh five. Got it. Okay. So boop boop boop. Is that the ring sound? One socket. Okay, oh, that was just like the tutorial. Ominous. Love that. It looked like we were living in a basement. And whose phone? Hello, can you hear me? Uh. Thank you for your participation. Who's this? Though the purpose of this experiment is classified, I'll do my best to help you by going through some of the basics of how this test will work. Let's start by taking a look at the generator. It's in the corner of the room. The generator will give power to your devices. I would advise you to keep it powered. Okay. Click and hold the handle. 
Move it in a circle to charge it. Please charge it all the way. Oh, the green bar's going up. Got it. Almost there. Very good. Now, look towards the room again. You have one. Socket. <laughs> oh, in one, two, three, four different devices. One socket to power all your devices. Now, to power a device, simply click on the plug of that device. Try it now. Click the plug located on the bottom left okay, of the socket. You may have wondered how you can complete this experiment. Well, look behind you. You'll need a, oh, a code to complete this experiment. When you survive long enough, I will call you on this phone and tell you a digit of the code. Now let me tell you about the clock. Please, plug it in. Uh, wait. Is this the clock? Very good. If you look towards it, you will see time ticking up. I'll give you digits of the code periodically as this timer goes up. So remember to keep it plugged in if you want to get out of here. Now, turn on the close lamp again. Okay. There's a speaker hanging on the wall. You'll need it to scare away the creature in the dark. Oh, that light was a camera. The noise from the speaker is the only thing, uh, only thing it fears. Look closely at the speaker. See the amount of charge it has left. The charge is limited. If it runs out, you have nothing to defend yourself with. That was everything for me. Good luck. Oh boy. Okay, so... Let's start the timer. I guess like every so often I need to Was I charging it up or is that using the charge? I think it was using it because this is a little bit em more empty. Oh boy, so I have to like juggle these different plugs. Okay, uh, boop. Mm -hmm. I'm am I doing this right? Oh my God. It's not like it was like right there. I'm like halfway done already. Oh no. Call me. Give me a number. Okay. 
Oh, good, 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 good. Uh, you're doing well. I've got another challenge for you. No, no more challenges. Okay. Plug in the close lamp and look at the wall behind you. Okay. This puzzle will test your memory. Okay, so green, white. Yeah. I let this die. Oh no. Anyways, first code is six. Okay, let me get this going. It'd be nice if there's a way to like just spam click this rather than having to like actually rotate my mouse. I'm shaking the shit on my entire desk right now doing this. I'm like worried that it's gonna knock my camera over. the shit out of me. I already used so- oh. I already used so much of the, uh, the juice on the thingy. Okay, so I don't have to use this- Hi again. I forgot to say that we have had instances of where the clock display would break. But don't worry, when this happens, it is just a display that is broken. It will still know the valve timer. It's able to call you at the appropriate times. Got it. Oh boy. This is tense. I hear something. Uh, the sound design is so freaky. That scared me. Hurry up and get out of there. The monster is getting very aggressive. I have another puzzle for you. Okay, let me... What is this? The second digit of the code is... One. Okay, so we're like six, one. Oh, this display's broken. God, I am shaking the shit on my desk. It was like a shitty little IKEA desk. Okay, so what is this? I don't understand. I, huh? I'm trying to understand what those symbols mean, but I'm also like trying to keep the generator going, trying to keep an eye on the monster.
Okay, so this symbol plus this symbol equals that. I don't I don't understand. I wonder if that's like a hint for a later puzzle. Oh, this. Oh, okay. Hold on. Nope. Wrong one. Okay, so the first one is this, like, three-looking thing. Oh, I see. So you're actually just combining the symbols. Got it. Okay, so V, then an R. Looks like a five. Charge this shit back up. Oh my god. This has me, like, actually panicking. There's like so many different things to juggle that I'm like, Ugh. okay. So VF, got it. And then it looks like. this. Did that recharge my shit? Hello? Did I do it? Digit of the code is zero. Okay, so six one zero. Oh my god. Well done. Now the next challenge awaits. Now it's gassing me. Ugh. Damn. Damn. Yeah, thanks for playing. Uh, get the full version, uh, full version and experience. Uh, the break room, another escape room, and custom games. Yeah. So the main game comes out, I think, in about 10 days. Uh, I'll definitely be checking this out. That was really good. That had me stressed out. I do want to see what happens if we die, though. Yeah, let's see what happens if we if we die.
Hello. I totally just like stared at it. It didn't do anything. Is that a little timpani roll? A little drum? I'm dead. Yeah. <laughs> I knew I was dead. This still scared me. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, this is really good. This is tense. It gives you a lot to, like, keep track of. There's the clock. There's how much charge you have left in the speaker. There's the puzzles to recharge the speaker. There's where the location of the monster is. Then there's the generator. Like, that's, that's a lot. That's really good. Oh, cool. If you don't play it yourself, link is in the description. Uh, I'll definitely be checking out the main game when it comes out. Yeah. I like the style of it, too. The sound design is really good. Uh, I like the, like, pseudo-pixelated look. Yeah. Good stuff. Well, cool. That's another short one for the week. I know I've been doing a lot of super long playthroughs lately. Uh, gonna try to add a few more little baby ones in here and there. Um, yeah. All right. Leave a like, it really helps. And if you have any recommendations for other games to cover, please leave a comment. And I will see you all next time. Bye.